Oh, I found a couple more patches. I've had to plane back the door frame to get the screen to fit because it was rubbing all the way along there. It's now, now I've got to paint it. It probably won't fit again. So these were the two that I stripped back. That one's new and that one's new. We got rid of the table, kind of closed in the end of the, the deck. My wife actually said she wanted, had a thought of having a fold down one because this makes this area feel a bit more open. So I've got this here, wraps around the post. Comes across the corner. Bit of a change not having the dark timber. Just take a crap on my floor. Hmm. Cheeky bugger. There's it in. Now waiting to see what I'm going to do with the mess he made on the floor. Cheeky bugger. with myself. This is the base plate of my saw that I bought not long back. It fell off the bench and can you see that bend in it? There's a bend here and also in the adjustment rod. It was the rod that I noticed first. So let's see if I can get that bent back to as flat as possible. I think I got it. Now I'll just go and check the rod, the adjustment lever. This is the other bit that got bent. Because I had the base plate down because I was only making a shallow cut. So, seems like it's only bent in the one direction. So I'll just straighten that out as well. Got it. I think that was the only thing that was the issue. Put everything back together and have a look. Just spotted, I don't know why I didn't see it while I was working on it, the scuff mark on this back corner of the base plate, which is where it hit the deck out there on the gravel.
just spent his money on a brand new saw and drop it. The guide rail, guide bar bent as well because I had a piece of timber on it so it had a nice long straight edge because so I was ripping a board and I was sitting there adjusting it for the next rip. And that happened, slipped and fell. Anyway, it's okay now. I was going to try and get a bench top made for this today until I dropped the tool that I needed to do the job. <laughs>